This tiny device is so powerful that some governments have banned it completely. But is it actually a Swiss army knife for digital security? Or just an overhyped Tamagotchi? I mean, how can something that looks so basic have sparked major security concerns? More on that later. The Flipper Zero is essentially a multi-tool for cybersecurity professionals, ethical hackers, and tech lovers. It can scan and interact with RFID, NFC, infrared signals, and even wireless networks. But that's not all. It can scan and copy things like office key cards. So instead of carrying multiple cards, you can store them all in one place. It works as a universal remote Remote, letting you control TVs, air conditioners, and other infrared devices. It can even analyze Wi-Fi signals and interact with IoT devices. But here's where it gets complicated. It has a bad USB feature, which can plug into a computer and automatically type commands as if someone were using the keyboard. And with custom firmware, it can send signals that interfere with some wireless devices. The Flipper Zero is completely legal in the USA if used responsibly. But in places like Brazil and Canada, it's been banned because of misuse. If you're into cybersecurity, the Flipper Zero is a fascinating tool that can replace multiple expensive devices. But if you're expecting Hollywood-style hacking, you may be disappointed. So what do you think? Should Flipper Zero be banned, or is it just misunderstood? Let us know in the comments and follow for more cool gizmos.